So we know that particular area, we're in good shape. Now one thing you want to be careful of is when you have your feet back away from the device when you're down on the floor like I am or kneeling down because if you move your foot next to that device it will pick your foot up <laughs> as movement. So then we go down about 16 inches and we do it again such as that and if it goes back down to zero we know we don't really have anything going on there so you can move on and now it reads about six inches either side of it that we found goes out about six inches either side so you have to be careful when stuff is in the room if you got some blinds that are moving or something of that nature it's possible that you could be picking up those blinds now what we found here is we did find some exit holes down this wall here and this one here we didn't get any readings there but lo and behold when we put it right here look what happens we have no readings on the accelerometer so we know we have no vibrations no movement no we're not moving it it's sitting still against that wall but we have steady moving up above and when you do the graph on this when you go to record it and do your graph on this you will get uh, it will show little jump ups all the way down the graph and that way you know you have live activity.